I was really impressed. You turned what might have been an inscrutable topic into one that should have inspired each and every one of us. Now, whenever I evaluate a manual speech, I like to take a look at the objectives from the manual. This had two objectives. The first was to collect information about your topic from numerous sources. More about that later. And second, carefully support your points and opinions with specific facts, examples, and illustrations that gathered through research. Well, you certainly have some excellent content there. Wow, you did so many things right. You started out with a really punching, punching opening. You said, is this the truth? Well, you got our attention immediately. And you expounded upon what Rotary is all about. What is a Rotarian? You talked about that. I noticed that after you gave your initial introduction, you were not afraid to leave the lectern and speak without notes to the audience. This was very, very good. You gave specific examples of what Rotary does with regards to uh, building water towers and combating polio, both internationally and locally with regards to the YMCA. And you talked about fundraising. Now, there are many specific things that you did right in this. Use the word for the day. You related to the audience. You used humor. Hopefully, everyone took a shower in the last 24 hours. That got a good <laughs> chuckle. You had good voice modulation. It wasn't monotone. That built the excitement. You had good eye contact with us. This was excellent. And at the end, you had a call to action both with regards to donations and visiting the club. This was a great speech. Now, I have to really stretch to find something that you could have done better. And if there was one thing you might have done better, it would be to match the speech to the objectives in the manual, because you were really the source and personally knew everything that you were talking about. Maybe not internationally, but 